Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Trey, and let's talk about Disney. And the reason why I want to talk about Disney is because how about we do a switcheroo with Disney, if that makes sense. So as you guys know, Disney um, was created by Walt Disney World. He had all these cool characters like Mickey Mouse, Donald Duck, Goofy, Minnie Mouse, Daisy, you know, that kind of stuff. Then, you know, they became popular for their little fairy tales, taking like folklore stories um, from around the world of these princesses stories and changing them, you know, to make them a little bit more kid friendly or entertaining for the family. And I thought about it and I thought I was like, you know what, that'll be a good I, I um, that'll be a good idea. We should do something like that. Right. And what I mean is, later on, it became one of the most popular um, franchises, not franchises, but um, media corporation companies of all time. And then at the same time, they brought Star Wars and, and Marvel. Now, if you guys don't know, the reason why Marvel and Star Wars was brought is because they wanted a big male audience to come into Disney. Because even though they had a male audience, their male audience was smaller than their female audience like us guys will show up for certain movies or whatever but the target audience really is females and little girls um so they decided to create disney xd they decided to um buy marvel and star wars so they can get the male audience right well they decided to get activists and losers and weirdos in there who had an agenda who wanted to change these characters around for political views and whatever so they decided that they need to enforce more female characters into Marvel and Star Wars, um, diversity and inclusion, LGBT stuff, right? And that, that that's fine and dandy because they own the franchises and the properties. But what's happening is that since their target audience were men, men didn't really take to it like they thought they would. And they kind of screwed up the pooch for them. But what I want to, what I'm saying is, why don't we let them have Marvel and Star Wars, right? Why don't Disney take all of their their properties beforehand that they had and make them male orientated? You get what I'm saying? So how about we do a reign of like Disney Prince movies, where it's about a strong heterosexual male saving a day winning the girl he's a prince um she's a either a peasant girl or she's another princess it depends who cares it really doesn't matter the focus is the focus is making sure we get feet and we get male character male audience attention so all of the all of the classic disney movies or whatever and stuff like that um, that had focus on females why don't we reverse it and have a focus on males and the same thing with like their their disney plus and disney um disney channel shows um that aren't marvel and star wars why don't we have a very focus on the men less um belittle the women um less the men um know more than the women um let's have great action and uh great storytelling character development for the for the for the men the girls nah they don't really get that much development they they there but uh, you know what i'm saying um and let's let's have a let's have a big a big old explosion of like more disney prince princess showing up in the parks and throughout disney um that'll be that'll be really cool um, let's, let's take some, let's make some, some alternate versions of Mickey Mouse in the gang, but you know, let's have them action based. Um, so, you know, make little Mickey Mouse shorts or whatever, but action based, that would be really cool. I think that'll be really swell. It'll, it'll balance everything out because since their, since their original plan was to get, um, a male audience and they had it and then they swandled it. Why don't they just change everything about the stuff that they originally have themselves and then turn that more male focus? Fair is fair, right? So that way females can have Marvel and um and Star Wars like they like Disney originally wanted them to have 
And then males can have the Disney Prince franchise or the Mickey Mouse action shorts. You know what I'm saying? Something that'll really target on the guys. That'll be really cool. I mean, it, it makes the most logical sense out of all. You know, you you already destroyed the male the male audience um, from Marvel and Star Wars. Yeah, there's still males there, but for the most part, most people don't walk away from this these franchises because you wanted to focus on you know female empowerment, diversity, and inclusion, LGBT stuff. So you know why not go ahead and just. Um, make something else without having to worry or focus on, you know, um, having um, having Marvel and and Star Wars um, having to cater to their male audience, their predominant audience that they have. They could just create a new audience. You know, it makes so much logical sense. Like, yeah, we should totally do that. That that will definitely work, right? My, I mean, it's just a thought. It is definitely just a thought. Because if you're not going to change Star Wars and Marvel back to being um, a target, the target audience for men and a power fantasy for men, then, I mean, you might as well use the properties that you're not using anymore anyway and focus on getting the men to like that stuff. You know, You know what I'm saying? That means you. That means all that agenda stuff goes to Marvel and Star Wars. Let um, let the females have that stuff, and then let the men have the rest of Disney products. But you target it for men, which means you make action figure um, Disney princes. You don't make no damn dolls or whatever and stuff like that. The dolls will be a little bit there. Um, we won't focus that much on the Disney princes princesses or female characters in the parks. You'll focus more on the male part, on uh, the male characters. That makes way more sense. And then you're gonna make a whole bunch of of commercials talking about think of the think of the um the little boys who will wanna grow up and become men. Um and you will make a lot of commercials that will that will push boys into STEM and mathematics and engineering. You need to you need you need more of that. That's what you can do. That that'll be really kind of cool to see um, see something like that. But I don't know. Um, that was just a that was just a thought. Honestly, um, I just thought maybe that would be something that could work. Since you know nowadays they want to make everything for females. They want to take male dominant things and make it female. Why don't we take the female dominant things and reverse that and make it for males, right? Right? Okay, then. Cool. But those are my thoughts. Tell me what you guys think in the comments below, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.